Well, there's a fierce family fight playing out in court today, and it hits close to Honolulu's police chief. Chief Louis Kealoha's wife is being accused of deception by her own grandmother and her uncle, too. KITV Force Cam Tran was in the courtroom as that family friction played out. The financial feud between Catherine K. Aloha and her uncle and grandmother is twofold. First, Gerard Puana, K. Aloha's uncle, claimed he gave her $70,000 cash. Gerard Puana asked for receipts for his cash, never got any receipts. But one thing that Mr. Puana has are his calendar entries. However, K. Aloha's attorney tried to discredit Gerard's claim that he gave K. Aloha the money. Gerard Puana, on his disability income, is claiming. That he managed to save $70,000 in cash, which he gave to Kathy Kilo to invest, with a promise of interest of 30% a year. The first payment was given to her in a paper bag at Kahala Mall. No receipts, no witnesses. The second issue includes the purchase of a condo in the Greenwood Apartments in Salt Lake. Gerard wanted to buy the condo he couldn't afford. Gerard's mother, Florence Puana, who is also Ke Aloha's grandmother, used a reverse mortgage on her home to cover the condo's cost. The Puana's attorney claims Ke Aloha was supposed to pay the reverse mortgage, but instead took the money. Catherine Ke Aloha opened a joint account with Florence Puana. The funds from the reverse mortgage went into this joint account. Greenwood was purchased, and the balance. Of the funds, which was roughly 148,000, was used, it was spent, and with cash was withdrawn. However, K. Aloha's attorney says it was Gerard who was supposed to pay the reverse mortgage, and it was K. Aloha who put down the deposit for the condo, and the Puanas owed her money. I'm going to get the, the reverse mortgage pretty soon, so I'll pay you back. And that's how it started. You know, more and more monies were being asked of Kathy. What complicated matters worse is both attorneys say the Puanas were hiding the reverse mortgage from the rest of the family because of favoritism. So the bank statements went to Kay Aloha's mailbox. When the mortgage interest accrued and Florence was forced to sell her home, the Puanas blamed Kay Aloha and filed a lawsuit setting up this court battle. Cam Tran, KITV4 News. Gerard was charged with stealing the Kilohas mailbox. That's a federal crime. A federal judge dismissed that charge after the police chief brought up Gerard Puana's criminal past during the trial. The federal public defender alleges the Kilohas framed Puana to discredit him in this civil case.